Ida Kohlmeier, Traditional Symbols, Cursive Alphabet. Ida Kohlmeier wrote, I've experienced an elevation of spirit, almost a mystical happening where I am not doing the painting. It evolves under its own mysterious power. This exquisite state of being stimulates a religious experience. Even today, many artists will say that they really create their best work when we would say they're in a flow of the energy and the work takes over and they merely become the vehicle for it. Ida was a very interesting woman. Um, she had chosen to, to stay a housewife in New Orleans, even though she was very much in with the Rothko, Cole Meyer, uh, Gottlieb group and would go up to New York on occasion and take classes with them. They actually even came and stayed with her in New Orleans, but she chose to stay a housewife. And because of that, her work never received the same public acknowledgement as her very good friend Louise Nevelson did. She also um, was a, a very soft woman, and these images reflect that part of her being. They are the cursive, and just like in the United States right now, we don't write, handwrite very much, and nor is handwritten um, cursive Hebrew used very often any longer, but it nonetheless does have soft curves, and I felt that it was a very appropriate image for her to put on all of the glyphs in cursive, and that's what this image represents, uh, both the letter and then the glyph that is associated with it. I also had an interesting experience in speaking to Ida's daughter, uh, because Ida had passed when I did this, and told her that I was asked her if her mother was into astrology because she was very much into symbolism and her daughter said absolutely not and I had already done the alphabet using the odiotes for celestial uh, the celestial symbolism and when I asked the question and her daughter said no I had no choice but to abandon it and as it turned out she became perfect for this and Gottlieb became perfect for the celestial for the Celestial series. So it was, as we say in Hebrew, Beshirt, meant to be. Thank you for taking your time to watch this video. If you would like to engage with my work for academic use or for purchase, I would love to hear from you through my website linked in the description below.